Hi, this is Dan Johnston from TechItOut.com, and I noticed on WebClicky, which is a service I use to track traffic to my website, similar to Google Analytics, I'll probably talk about that later. I noticed that a lot of people were searching for things related to AppDabs just here alone, just in the last five searches, uh, reduce tab space, Firefox says pin tab mean, what does pin tabs, what does pin tab means, pin as app tab, and so a lot of people are wondering about pin tabs, and so I'm going to make a video on that. Now, I already wrote a comparison of pin versus app tabs, and a lot of people might think it's copying, copying Google Chrome pin tabs, but actually, or app tabs rather, but actually pin tabs is a lot better. So go to techitoff.com slash pin versus app tabs to, uh, to, to get that post, no commas, and, and, but in this video I'm going to talk about what pin tabs are. So what pin tabs are, so you can see here I only have two tabs open in Firefox right now. But often people have many tabs open. Tons of different tabs. Now tell me if this has looked like your browser. Tons of tabs. So many that that you got in these scroll bars here. So just just scroll through them. So this is very common. Most people have maybe a dozen, two dozen uh, tabs open up once, and that's just in one window. Many people have my, more windows as well, so people have tons of tabs. And it's often hard to find everything, especially when it gets so small, like this, uh, like it's difficult to really tell. You can look at the fave icon, but not all sites have fave icons, and even that sometimes can get difficult to see. And the fave icon is, is like that icon there, you can see it's blank there, that, there. My site doesn't have a fave, a fave icon yet, although, although it will soon. But, so what pin tabs does is you right click, and you click pin as app tab. You right click on the tab, and press pin as app tab. So now, this in this case, my website, has gone to showing only the fave icon. So, it doesn't have any fave icon, so let's unpin that tab. And, uh, I, 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 again, I'll, I'll have a fave icon soon, but so, that's a better example. So, pin that, and now, it's over here. So, why you, they still have this scroll thing, so you have to scroll through these different tabs. The most important tabs are are over here outside of that. So you can see this the scroll thing is 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 to the right of this. So like you open up more things like Google Reader, make that pin as app tab, and so now you can see so. So maybe your mail, and that, see, so you can see now, already we have three different things over here. So you, so what this does, pin tabs, is you pin these tabs, and and so, um, and they become a part of this thing over here. And it's a really good feature. If you, like, if you have many tabs, you often browse with many tabs. You have many tabs, and you want to be able to find the ones you use most often quickly. Again, your reader, your mail, whatever it is. Maybe a news site, whatever it happens to be. You just put that over, you just right click and press pin and pin, or, sorry, you, you just right click, pin as app tab, and it goes over there. Sorry about that. Anyways, yeah, so that's all that you need to do. 
and then it goes over here. So you can see there are definitely benefits to that. Um, there are some unbenefits, <laughs> if, if you can call it that, in that, like, uh, like if you had this unpinned, um, and, and, um, for example, oops, sorry. If you had that unpinned, then it would show you if, in, like, if you didn't have many tabs open, it would show you that. So this is not a feature for people who have, who have only a few tabs open and browse with only a few tabs, or maybe even not any tabs. No, this is a feature for people who frequently browse with you know, 10, 15, 20, or more tabs. So this is a, a good feature, so that's all you need to do. And this feature was included in Firefox 4, so you need to have Firefox 4, Firefox 5, Firefox 6, which is in beta at the time of recording, or even earlier, because they have like a pre-beta thing as well. Uh, kind of like Chromium with, with the Google, it's ahead of the Google Chrome beta, that's what the Firefox thing is. Um, yeah, so if you're still on Firefox 3 or even earlier, you need to upgrade in order to get this feature, but it's well worth it. And, um, and if you want to see why it's better than Google Chrome app tabs, then just go to techhelp.com slash pin versus app tabs. So check my website, techhelp.com. See you there. Bye.